Now, shifting gears for the balance of the next 20 minutes uh, is Gary Franci, uh, who heads up Revolution Pack, and he's always uh, you know, doing new uh, great work in the fight for Ron Paul. And I just want to know, in the case of uh, James Williams, who's in the piece from South Texas on the coast, where Ron Paul was a physician for many years, how on earth did you guys find James Williams? Uh, because uh, this has certainly got the media covering it. Uh, and uh, pretty upset because it humanizes Ron Paul. Alex, thanks for having me on the show. Uh, yeah, James Williams, you know, he's like a needle in a haystack. Um, you know, Alex, Ron Paul has delivered over 4,000 babies uh, in his medical career. So you know there's plenty of stories more just like this. And because the Revolution Pack has uh, people who... Uh, used to work in the 2008 campaign, people who have always been very close to Ron Paul, uh, they have an institutional knowledge of past campaign tactics, uh, as well as the people that have been close to Ron. And through our sources within the pack, uh, we found James, and he said he would come through and perform the interview for us and, and help us uh, get his story out. Wow, well, and you sure got some good producers. All these ads look like, you know, million-dollar ads you're producing. Just an amazing job, Gary. Thanks, Alex. We uh, that ad was shot last uh, last Monday uh, in in Jamestown and in, in the in the congressional district of Ron Paul. Our crew flew out. Uh, we you know they flew out to Houston. They shot the ad on. They, they flew out Sunday. Shot the ad on Monday. Uh, we got two more videos that are going to be coming out uh, in this Who Is Ron Paul series that talk about. Ron Paul the man. Um, and of course, this one with James Williams talks about the compassion of Ron Paul. So uh, the, that video was shot Monday, and uh, our, our producing team put the video together through the holiday weekend uh, because we knew that this message needed to be heard, and uh, we, we, we fine-tuned it. Uh, in the past couple of days, we released it, and now it has over 250,000 views. And it's really stifling a lot of the arguments that uh, the media is trying to pin on Ron Paul. Of course, you know, we see the claims that he's some sort of a racist and a bigot. Um, and let's just be clear, this video is not specifically designed to address that. It's, it's, a vid it's one video in a series that addresses the, the Ron Paul the man. Uh, but we're already getting reports from people on the ground who... Uh, who they're, they're talking to individuals. They're trying to convert people to Ron Paul, and they say, oh, well, Ron Paul's a racist. Ron Paul's a racist. Well, then they go ahead, they pull this video up on their laptop or their iPhone, and they say, take a second and watch this video. And this video completely disarms the argument. So we have an initiative right now. We're trying to raise funds to get this broadcast on national television uh, and just you know get the message out, get James' story to the American people. Well, we're going to broadcast it right now to 3 million people. Go ahead and uh, play the ad. Here it is. It was uh, between 1972 and 73, but it was still a lot of prejudice around this area. My wife was sick and I was trying to get some attention for her. Nobody came to check. They just left her there. Well, I believe I was left there because of the difference, uh, me being black and her being white. and. Every time I would say something to her, he had noticed that she would get pretty upset. And then she finally called the uh, Freeport Police Department, said I was harassing her. And I mean, I, I didn't know anything to do. Well, then Ron Paul come to my rescue. He just stepped in and went to work with my wife. And after he seen her, uh, I'd say no more than 10 minutes later, she had a stillborn boy child. And he said as far as the bill, he would take care of everything, which he did. I never got a bill from the hospital or anything. And he was a doctor of medicine, and that's what he was doing, was practicing medicine. And it didn't matter who and what and why. He was doing it because he think of one human being just as much as another one. He's just a honest man, and that's something we need now in this day and time. It's a lot of politics and no honesty. When you have honesty, well, people will try to do anything to blot you out, and that's what they 
will try to do to him is plot him out because he will be honest. And they need more like him. All right. We're going to be back with Gary Franchi. There's another video where Ron Paul this morning on talk radio responded to the ad and he had some tears in his eyes. We'll talk to Gary Franchi on the other side of Revolution Pack. We'll give you that website if you want to get involved in supporting this. I tell you, Gary is really doing impressive work. And we can do exactly what the globalists do, but we use the truth, not lies. We can kick their you-know-whats if we just stand up and give them a fight. How did you... Uh, uh, that's a long time ago. How, uh, I'm sorry. Well, how did you... You know, this was... Uh, I just saw this a uh, little, little while ago. It wasn't put out by our campaign. It was put out by that, you know, the super PAC type stuff that are separated from the campaign. Okay. I'm amazed at how they found that. If you would have asked me to go back and find somebody like that, I wouldn't know. But... To me, I don't remember it. I don't recall it because it was one of, you know, just the way we practice medicine, you know, in a way at least I practice Obviously medicine. Obviously, it was so incredibly it was a, important to that guy. He it was a non-event non uh, in the sense that th that, I, that is what I thought my responsibilities were. Talking about, you know, sometimes he wonders why did I ever sign on to this to be attacked? Uh, but then he realizes that the truth will out. The truth will always come out. Perhaps we'll play that when we come back to the next segment. Gary, I got you on late today. I got to get you back on next week, but super job uh, with what you're doing. Uh, and uh, I can't wait. I mean, give us an idea of some of the other surprises coming out the next videos. Well, you know, when you go down to Congressman Paul's congressional district, there are so many people that have been touched by Paul. And we've spoken to people that have worked very closely with him in the in the medical field. Uh, we spoke to veterans. And uh, we've just got some compelling human interest stories that uh, the American people uh, are really going to relate to when they see these videos. Um, well, I've talked to his family and people who don't want to brag about him publicly. But I've also talked, living here in Texas, to people that have been medically touched by him. He would always volunteer part of the week at the horrible charity hospitals and stuff, not as some goody two-shoe, but he believed in not having big government. So uh, people that are strong are supposed to help the weak. He would go down and work basically for free at the charity hospitals. Well, you know, you might just see something like that coming out pretty soon. And, and the thing is, is that Ron Paul doesn't brag about himself, but the Revolution PAC will brag about Ron Paul. He's a great man, and we want to see him in the White House, and we're going to do everything we can to make sure that that happens, Alex. And, Gary, folks can give uh, unlimited to these uh, revolution packs. I mean, you've got a great name for the pack, uh, and uh, so if people go donate, you'll be able to run this two-minute commercial uh, on television to counter these people. And, I mean, even if you only get one one-hundredth of the donations the big mega banks give people like Mittens Romney, uh, or uh, scum like neutered Genrich, uh, a, a grain of truth shatters a mountain of lies. Well, Alex, w when we release the video, we've already received close to $40,000 in donations to support it. And people can go to revolutionpack.com. There's a ticker that they can keep track of uh, the support that we're getting. And it's, it's overwhelming, Alex. It's overwhelming. And that's, that's true. Uh, unlimited donations. So we can accept 10000 50000 even a million dollars to air a 60-second a version of what you're seeing in the two-minute version. Yeah. Well... Incredible. So when do we see the next ads coming out? Because he needs all the help he can get now. And obviously it's, it's being seen millions of times uh, online going going super viral. Uh, and it's important for people, whether it's your videos or our videos or other other you know, real media countering the uh, the Decepticon media. It is so important that people pass these videos on to others. Uh, again, when are we going to see the next videos come out? Uh, I'm going to talk to my producer today. We've been just reeling with the responses. Uh, Reuters just called. They want to talk to James Williams. Uh, the media has been communicating with us. Uh, the supporters out there are sending us emails. Uh, you know we'll why they want to talk to James Williams. They want to somehow twist it and attack it or something. Yeah, and, and we're being very sensitive on how we distribute James's content. Well, James seems like a pretty smart guy. He might not want to talk to the... By the way, I want to get James on this show. How do we do that, Gary? I meant to ask you that off air. Um, have uh, your producer email me, and uh, we'll, we'll get that uh, connected for you. Yeah, well, let's just get him on Sunday or Monday. Let's just... Uh, or, or let's do an interview today on the nightly news. I mean, I think it's important before they go, because they'll go interview him for two hours and cut it together to make him look bad. I mean, these are wicked devils. We know that. 
Absolutely. And uh, yeah, just have Jaron shoot me an email. We'll, we'll make sure that connection takes place and uh, see if we can establish an interview for you. Yeah, that's good. Only because, or you guys need to do an extended one right now, because you know that extended one, the first extended one to go out there is going to go viral versus letting them get the first extended interview, edit it, butcher it, uh, and then try to misrepresent. Because, I mean, again, we're dealing with criminals here. Well, look at the, look what they did to, to Ron Paul uh, in that CNN clip where they, they claimed that he stormed off the interview. When you watch the uncut version, he clearly didn't. Well, so she they, also they goes back on story. CNN and says, well, you saw it. He never answered the question. They edited it. He answers it three times. And then says, okay, I got to go. Thanks. That's the 10 minutes. And, and, and then they cut it before that and then never show him answer the question. CNN thinks their viewers are idiots. They hate you. They disrespect you. They think you're a joke. They love manipulating you. They count on you being ignorant. Well, All right, Gary, let me come out there and talk to you during the break. We got Max Kaiser coming up. But, yeah, in fact, I meant to try to work with you today to get him on while while we did this show today. But there's no time like the present. Uh, we, uh, we might need to go ahead and just get his phone number right now and do this on the nightly news this evening. Uh, we'll be right. Hell, I'm in Texas. I could, go to, I could go down there. We'll be right back. Stay with us. If you believe in this information and want to support its viral spread, go to the InfoWars store at InfoWars.com. We've got the new G.I. Joe InfoWars t-shirts. We've got the incredible ProPure gravity-fed filters available at InfoWars.com in the store. We've got a new DVD, Sinus Under Attack, the Don't Tread on Me flag. We've got all sorts of different bumper stickers to help spread the rebellion virally. It's all there, wristbands, citizen rule books in every order. Order online at InfoWars.com today. The water filters, the canteens, it's all there. InfoWars.com.